In this video, we are gonna have a look at how to use the URL redirect option to add redirect settings to your quiz. With this option, you can redirect people who take the quiz to one of your pages, your posts, or to an external URL, depending on the result they obtain in the quiz. So let's see how to do this. While you are setting up the structure of the quiz, you can decide what happens after someone takes the quiz. You can do that by using this section here. As you can see, by default, the results page option is selected. Open this dropdown to see both of the available options and click on the URL redirect option. Before going any further, please know that there are two possible versions of the URL redirect option, which are based on the type of the quiz that you are building. First, I will show you how this option, leading to the redirect settings page, looks like for the number, the percentage, and the right-wrong quiz types. Ok, now click on the Manage button to go on. As you can see, the redirect settings page opened. In order to add a redirect setting, click on the Add New button from here. Now a new section has opened on this page, with the help of which you will be able to create the redirect. First of all, you will have to set a range by entering a minimum value here and a maximum value here. In order to set this range, you can either use the up and down arrows that appear when you hover over the fields, or you can simply enter a value manually, like this. Now, if users will score between these values, they will be redirected to the content that you will specify next. So the following step is to define the place where the users who take the quiz and score within this range will be redirected to after they finish the quiz. To do this, you will need to use this part here. First, open the drop-down to see both of the options and then choose either content on this site or an external URL. Let's start with the first one. If you want to redirect users to a page or a post from your site, you will have to leave this option selected, and then you will have to search for the content, the page or the post that you want to add as a redirect in this section here. Simply click in the field and start typing the name of the page or the post that you want to use. A list will appear with results based on your search, and you can simply select the page or the post you want by clicking on it. After the content is selected, all you have left to do is click on the Save button. And as you can see, the first redirect has been added to this quiz. Now I'm going to add another redirect to this quiz in order to show you the external URL option. So once again we're going to click on the Add New button, set a range like this, and then choose an external URL from the drop-down. This option is useful if you want users to be taken to an external URL after they finish the quiz. An external URL means a link that cannot be found on your website, so content from a website that is different than yours. Click in the Add URL field here, and complete the field with the external URL that you want as the redirect for this range. After you have added the URL, click on the Save button again. Now you can see that we have set up two redirects for this quiz. You can set up more redirects like this for different ranges by using the Add New button again and repeating the steps to add another redirect. Now let's see how the redirect URL option and the redirect settings page looks like for a category quiz, like the one that I have here. Just as before, we will have to open the drop-down, select the URL redirect option, and then click on the Manage button. 
As you can see, this page is different from the redirect page for the other quiz types. This is because in this case, you have to set a redirect for each quiz category that you have previously set up in order for the redirect settings to work properly. The number of category results here represents how many categories your quiz has. Instead of defining ranges, in this case, you will have to set a redirect for each of the category results here. This way, you will be able to display different posts, pages or external URLs for each category so that the quiz takers will be redirected to different pages based on the category they have reached as a result for the quiz. As you can see, I have two categories for this quiz. Let's start with the extrovert category. In order to set a redirect for it, I will need to open the dropdown and choose one of these two options. Basically, these are the same options that we have used before for the other quiz types. Let's start with the redirect to content on site. If you use this option, you can search for a page or a post from your website in order to set it as the redirect. Click in the search for content field here and start typing the name of the post or the page that you want. Then look for the page in the list with the results and once you have found it, click on it to select it. As you can see, the page has been added automatically as the redirect for this category. The other option that you can use here is the redirect to external URL option. Just like in the case for the other quiz types, all you have to do here is to enter the external URL that you want to use and then click anywhere outside the field on the page. As you can see, this external URL has been automatically added as the redirect for this category. If you wish, you can edit any of the redirect settings by clicking on the pencil icon, the edit option, next to them. Furthermore, for every quiz type, you also have two additional options that you can use for the redirect settings. The first one is the display redirect message option. If you use this option, you can set up a customized message that will be displayed after someone finishes the quiz. In order to activate the option, simply check this checkbox. Here, you can set up the title, the actual message, and its duration as well. To do that, delete the default text from the field and replace it with the title, as well as the actual message that you want displayed for the quiz takers. Last but not least, you can also set up for how many seconds should this message be displayed. This is the default number, but you can simply delete it and replace it with the number that you want. The other additional option is the forward results to URL option. If you activate this by clicking on the checkbox, the specified parameters, meaning the name, the email, and the quiz result, will be forwarded to the URL of the post page or the external page that you have set up as the redirect. TechSavvy users can use these forwarded parameters to further customize the redirect page. After you have finished setting up the redirect settings, you can go back to the quiz using this button and continue customizing it to your liking.